Hey everybody, so I just put conditioner in my hair, conditioner and water so I can detangle. As you can see, it is tangled. Um, you got to see the before of what it looked like, especially in the last vlog. So I'm gonna let the conditioner sit in there for about a good 15 minutes and then I will begin the comb out process. Then we will wash and all that other stuff. So stay tuned. Okay, so as you can see on this side, this side has been combed out, it has been twisted. No, it's not washed yet, but I still have this side to do over here. Um, so what I'm doing is I'm putting it in three sections and combing it out just a little bit at a time. So I'm allowing that conditioner to soften the hair along with the water, and then, um, then I sit and I detangle. Um, I'm not going to show you. I thought about turning the camera on while I detangle it. But y'all, the faces I was making, I was like, yeah, no, they can't see all that. But anyway, um, so once I have this side detangled down, then um, I will twist this side up. Uh, probably run and do something quick. Um, excuse me, it is Saturday morning. And then once um, I'm done doing what I have to do, not run. I always say that. I say the wrong words. <laughs> Also, they ain't running nowhere right now. But anyway, um, once this side is detangled and twisted, then I will take a break, is what I'm trying to say. Take a break, sit down, maybe look at a little TV, um, and then uh, go back at it, untwist everything, wash everything, and move on from there. Okay, so both sides have been detangled. Both sides have been twisted up. You can see a little more condition on this side. I had to juice this piece up a little more just because um, it needed to be really detangled. So, uh, like I said, I'm going to now take a break. Um, let this condition just still sit in the hair. I still wanted to soften the hair. But I was able to, you know, detangle all the whole head. Um, so, yes, you can see conditioner up there. Um, my hair is dirty, so it's going to get washed. Um, and then... Uh, I will show you the after effects of washing it out, what it looks like after it's washed, and then go on from there. One thing I will say for um, our natural girls, um, ladies, when you are detangling your hair, it's best to start with a finger detangle first, especially if it's really tangled or if you're just coming out of braids. You know, make sure you have some water and some conditioner to soften it up, get, you know, kind of loosen up the dirt or whatever. Um, detangle with your fingers first. Also, when you are starting to do the comb out, start at the ends. Don't start at the roots. If you start at the roots, you're going to just pull, you know, all kinds of hair out. So you want to start at your, at your ends first, right? And work your way up the shaft to the, the scalp. So that's my tip. That's something that I learned the hard way years ago. So yeah, and you never, ever, ever want to do a comb out dry. Um, I've seen plenty of people who just comb their hair out and it's dry and all it does is snap, snap, snap. You know, give it some moisture. If it hasn't had moisture in a while, give it a lot of moisture. Let it sit, let it absorb um, and give it some conditioner. Or even if you have to put like a moisturizer on it just so it can loosen up and soften up before you start the comb out, okay? So let me go ahead and get a break and I'll be back. Okay, so this is the pre before going into the shower to get it washed. I took all the twists down, and now um, getting ready to go ahead and wash it. Okay, this is fresh out the shower, so I have to detangle again. <laughs> so for people who think that, oh, natural hair is easy, blah, 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 you just wash and go. Not if you want it to be, you know, a certain way. So, um, I wash, I deep condition. I'm going to put in a leave-in conditioner, detangle again and then go about my day um and i mean i'm like fresh out the shower too i'm still wet so anyway um yeah i'll show you what it looks like after i get the leave-in on and detangled today probably will be just a pull back ponytail because <laughs> i just don't have it in me but anyway so yeah stay tuned Okay, so here I have leave-in conditioner and moisturizer in my hair. I haven't begun the detangle with the comb or the detangle brush, just with my fingers. Wanna, you know, try to create less as possible, if, if at all possible, of hair coming out. But um, 
Yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and detangle this and then I'll show you the end result. Okay, so I wanted to show you the back first. Hopefully you can see it, the lighting, but it's all detangled in the back. Yes. <laughs> and here's the front. So um, all I did was put some leave-in on it as well as um, moisturizer and I combed it through and the detangle was very, very easy, which was so nice. And then once I decided to put this little headband on that you can barely see up there, I didn't want nothing big. Um, then I just put some oil on it too, just to kind of give it some oil. Because uh, you will definitely want to moisturize as well as oil the hair. But this is it. So uh, since it's all curly, you can't see the true length of it, but it has been detangled. And I did want to show you um, what I used. Not products, but... Um, this is something that you definitely want to have. It's a game changer, one of these combs. Now this comb I've had ever since I was a teenager, I think. My mom, my sister, and I, we have the same exact comb. They do sell these combs at Dollar Tree, but they're not as best quality, I would say. Um, this is old school right here. <laughs> so, and sorry you saw a little uh, product on it. Yeah, I put a lot of product on my hair. The other thing that I use for detangling, and I don't use this until I am done washing, conditioning, um, moisturizing, leave-in conditioner. Um, once I do the comb out again, I use one of these kind of brushes. So, as you see, it has product still on it, but I'm getting ready to wash it. But anyway, this is a game changer too. I got this brush at... Um, Walmart. I know they do sell it on Amazon as well. So anyway, I know I have been promising for, I don't know, probably a year to show kind of like my, what I do with my hair. You know, everybody wants to, well, how do you do your hair like that? First of all, my hair is natural. So this is truly after being washed, conditioned, blah, blah, blah. You see the curls are there. I've been natural since 2016. Don't plan to go back to the creamy crack no time soon. So with that being said, y'all, I am done with this video. Thanks for watching. See y'all in a new video. Bye.